So the big question is this, how do investors like us who trade options and manage our own money generate income regardless of where the stock market goes and do it all in a way that lets us make time for the people and things we love and yet still build wealth and remain profitable? That's the question and this podcast will give you the answer. I'm your host, Kirk Duplessis, and you're listening to The Daily Call from Option Alpha. Hey everyone, this is Kirk here again at Option Alpha and welcome back to The Daily Call. Today, we are going to be talking about why you shouldn't use your day job as an excuse for not trading options. So I do see this a lot. I see people using, and in this case, we'll just say your day job or your regular job as an excuse for why you shouldn't be trading options. But I don't think it's just that. I think there's other things that people use as excuses or crutches, if you will. They use kids, they use their wife, they use their basketball team. I've seen people use their kids' swim practice as excuses. I I can't trade because they have swim practice every day. But ultimately, I think you should find time to trade if it's important to you. And I think, frankly, your money is important to you or it should be important to you. You work really hard for your money, as do I. And I wouldn't want you to just blow it and kind of like throw it into the market. I'm actually just fascinated by that whole concept that people have or just this underlying psychology in in the world that, you know, money that we earn and we work so hard for should just be given up to somebody else or to the market or a brokerage house or a financial advisor. It's fascinating to me that people work so, so hard to earn their money and care so much about their job and, and what they do and budgeting. And then when it comes time to actually invest their money, They kind of don't think that they have an obligation to really work hard at that as well. And I think you do. I think you owe it to yourself to make sure you understand what the heck you're doing with your money and where it's going, right? I don't think a job or a swim practice or anything is an excuse. I think you can find time in the day to make trades. Yes, your job might not have internet access to get to the market. So your broker platform might be locked out. Find a way around that. Can you trade at lunch? Can you take a break? Can you place your trades early in the morning and use contingent orders. Like there's a way to do it. You just may not be looking at that avenue right now. You got to be creative in how you, you know, approach this. The second thing I'll say on this is that as you've probably heard by now, or you have been hearing about our new auto trading platform, that's going to be rolling out in the next couple of weeks. We don't have a definitive date right now, but we're, you know, exceptionally close to rolling it out. That is the premier reason why we're doing this is for people like you that have limited time. And and even like me, I think there's a lot of reasons why a fully automated trading platform, which literally nobody has in the entire market, this is revolutionary software that we're going to be rolling out to everybody. Nobody in the market has this. And it's because I want to, and our team wants to overcome this time hurdle or this time challenge that everybody has. Everybody wants to trade. I think a lot of people want to trade. Everybody understands trading. But what they don't yet have is the ability to make trades or use a system or bot to make trades based on a strategy or assumptions. Everything right now has to be manually clicked. That creates its own challenges, right? Everything has to be clicked. I've got to click through all my trades. You've got to click through all your trades. And that's a hurdle that now we're going to cross over to where we can build a bot or a strategy that does everything we try to do automatically without us having to interact with it unless we want to. And that is really, really cool stuff. And I think that will also help because now you won't have truly an excuse. You won't have an excuse to say, I don't have enough time or I don't have you know, time in my day. I have you know, sw- my kids swim practice, whatever it is, that will no longer be an excuse. You will only be limited by the ability to just truly go in for an hour or two, maybe at tops, maybe at tops. Usually it's going to be like you know, 10 minutes or so just to clone a bot or clone a strategy and let it you know, get it set up and go. But after that, it's going to be on autopilot for you. And that's really, really cool. So I still think, though, if you're trading and you use your job as an excuse, I think you can work around it. So try to figure out a way you can do it. And of course, let me know if you have any questions. Until next time, happy trading. Thanks for joining us on The Daily Call. Be sure to subscribe right now for more daily options trading ideas, strategies, and tactics to help you learn how to play smarter, more profitable trades. And if you like what we're doing, don't forget to give us a rating and a review so we can continue to bring you the best daily content possible. We'll see you again tomorrow right here on The Daily Call from OptionAlpha.com.